This episode is brought to you by CoolStuffInc.com, the number one seller of games and gaming accessories. And GatheringMagic.com, the number one resource for Magic the Gathering, news and articles. Hi, my name is Chris, and this is my Chainer Dimension Master Master. So my general is Chainer Dimension Master. Uh, he's a 3-3 three, three for 5 mana. Um, what he does is you can pay 3 black mana and 3 life to reanimate a creature from any graveyard. Um, also any creatures reanimated with him get plus 1 plus 1, but on the downside when Chainer leaves play all creatures reanimated with him uh, get exiled. So starting off the mana base, I have a very simple mana base. It's just uh, 35 swamps and then at the very end I have Bajuka Bog for graveyard hate and Cabal Coffers to ramp mana. Um, so yeah, these are the creatures that have uh, effects when they either enter or leave the battlefield, so they're good reanimation targets for Chainer. Uh, this one, when it comes into play, each play player sacrifices a creature. Usually I just sacrifice the Marauder, and um, then I can do it again. Bone Shredder, same thing, kills something, then when... Uh, on my next upkeep, I sacrifice it and I can use it again. Necrotal, Shriek Ma, Duplicant, and uh, so yeah, those, and where is it? Cool. Alright, those are all creatures that, um, when it comes into play, kill something. Massacre Worm is good for he handling tokens. Dark Hatching, there's one I was thinking of, just another Necrotal type effect. Uh, Runescar Demon's really good, it's a demonic tutor whenever it comes into play. Soul Ring, so yeah, this the mana ramp. Soul Ring's obviously a staple. Black Market, whenever a creature is put into a graveyard, I put a charge counter on it, and then at the on my main phase, for, I add a mana for every charge counter on it. Gauntlet of Power, just doubles my mana. Magus of the Coffers, same as the land. Nirkana Revenant and Cage Sun, also both double swamps. And then here's a few cards for life gain since I have to pay three life whenever I reanimate something with Chainer. This helps get that back. So Sangromancer, Chancellor of the Dross just for lifelink, and then a few drain life effects. So drain life, consume spirit, and exsanguinate. And then um, most of the reanimation I just do with Chainer, but there are a few cards that also help with that. Buried Alive, uh, put three creatures in my graveyard, which I can then reanimate. Same with Nazumi Grave Robber and Shieldred. Now for some uh, few tutor effects, Expedition Map, usually for Cabal Coffers, but Bajuka Bog if I really need Graveyard Hate. Crater's Grasp, just really useful for getting anything I need from an opponent's deck. Diabolic Tutor, since Demonic Tutor is in a different one of my decks. Liliana Vest, reusable tutor. And then uh, now for some card draw. Phyrexian Arena and Graveborn Muse each draw me an extra card a turn. Mind's Eye draws a lot of cards. Promise of Power draws five cards, and if I have the mana, also makes a big demon. Illuminated Folio, a little expensive to put out there, but after it's out, it's just one mana per card. Now some um, instant speed removal, Victim of Night, Go for the Throat, High Blight's Ending, Ren Flesh, Tendrils of Corruption, which also doubles as some life gain. Now some uh, non-instant speed removal, so Creatures Enchantments, No Mercy, just discourages people from attacking me. Likewise, Royal Assassin, drawn out kills things and also swings for a lot of damage. Sorry, the Dreadful. Dread, again, discourages people from attacking. Butcher of Malakir. Kalitas. Avatar of Woe. Now for mass removal, I've got Oblivion Stone. Nevenerals Disc. Damnation. Mutilate. Life's Finale, which also gives uh, reanimation targets for Chainer. Decree of Pain, which draws a lot of cards. 
re-redeem it. Which doesn't work well with uh, Chainer's reanimation, but even so, just uh, killing all my almost all my opponent's creatures is just worth it anyway. And then Plague Wind, very expensive mass removal, but again, just one side Wrath God is very good. Now here's just some random utility cards: Lightning Greaves, Protect Chainer, or Attack with, uh, Big Things the turn to come out, Mimic Fat, also good with Enter the Battlefield effects, Temporal Extortion, either opponent an opponent has to pay half their life or I get to time walk. Phyrexian Obliterator, really good for discouraging attacks. Obnixilis, just swings for a lot mostly. Painful Quandaries, a very annoying card to play against because they have to take 5 damage or discard whenever they play a spell. Choice of Damnations, also really good if someone's going nuts, say with a green ramp they just have a ton of permanence out. They either have to lose a lot of permanence or just lose a lot of life. Haldoza, really good for getting rid of non-basic lands. And Profane Command, which is all good with the mana doubling and also a reanimate spell. Thanks for watching CMDR Decks. Uh, thanks for watching and please subscribe.